Guys, so I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna play another campaign trail. This is a 1968 uh, campaign, and yeah, I'm gonna play as I'm gonna play as Nixon again. Uh, so the 1968 election enters its final stretch in chaos. Riots are frequent occurrence as the Vietnam War divides the nation. And Johnson, President Johnson's great society is under full attack. And Nixon attempts to present himself as a law and order candidate who will bear the standard of republicanism. And Humphrey will try to hold the line of liberalism in a year of social chaos and racial agitation. And the third party candidate, uh, George Wallace, he's going to hope for an end to civil rights and DC segregation and end to that so there's richard nixon nixon changed he's from california but he changed his home state to new york because he was a he was a lawyer there but he he became a lawyer in new york after he lost the governorship in california so once left for dead politically the 1968 runner-up turns it to the national stage marketing himself as the new nixon Politically, Nixon will hammer the issues of law and order and ending the war in Vietnam. He hopes to pick up enough mainstream support to split the difference between Humphrey's liberalism and hum Wallace's extremism. So, the one I'm going to pick here is uh, Reagan. Uh, Rockefeller and... Yeah, Rockefeller and Romney, I mean, that's just a northern campaign. With Reagan, you can win all sorts of states. I don't recommend. Well, at this election, you have a third-party candidate who does really well in the South, so... Reagan, in my... Let's play... In my experiences, um, he does the best everywhere, so... I'd select him. Agnew, I think, is pretty good, too. Or... Well, no, Ag Agnew's a bit weird, but... Yeah, I do Reagan. The other ones I don't have very much experience with, and I don't think they're very good, honestly. But... So, Nixon and Reagan... So the overall uh, theme of your campaign, first option, uh, yeah, that, that's, that's really, cons well, the third, the third and first options are really conservative, fourth one's, I think, too liberal, and the second one is the best one, because it talks about law and order and what's going on, so... Uh, I'll focus my speech. Um. Yeah, the third, third one's the best one. First one's too hawkish, second one's too liberal again, and the fourth one's too conservative, so. You want to talk about law and order. That's how you get. That's how Nixon won this election. So I'm gonna to go to New York. See, see how big of a lead I got. Because Reagan gives you a big lead. So, what's your opinion on Johnson's new Medicare program? Uh, we need to be very cautious. The other ones are too. Again, you want to be in the middle, not too conservative, not too liberal. Fourth one's way too liberal. Don't select, absolutely do not select the fourth one. And this one's RNG. I'm just going to pause. And So yeah, this is, so yeah, the other, this question is luck based. I think most times you get, uh, you lose the debate, but. I don't like RNG events in this game, like luck-based events. I think they're pretty stupid, honestly. I think, like, one... This one is two. I think that's way too many. Just one event. But, anyway...
it's it, at least it's better than this 1961 anyway but uh yeah that's the best you can do with that uh texas uh yeah i'll go down there uh yeah first one do not do that second one uh, yeah, the fourth one, do the fourth one, the fourth one is a bug, don't select that one, second one is like a Wallace answer, yeah, the third one. You want to be like, like a moderate conservative, okay. I don't know why Humphrey leads by such a wide mark. Okay, anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to run my campaign. Uh... Yeah, local matter. The other ones are too, like, liberal or too conservative, so. So, yeah, I'm, I'm leading by, like, a landslide here. That could go down, though. Uh, let me see. I'm thinking about what I should do here. So, yeah, I'm leading by a lot there. Connecticut. I'm going to go to West Virginia. Um, yeah, third one, improve our policing practices. Actually, I don't know. I guess criminals over law abiding. That's what I do. Uh... <laughs> yeah, to the bargaining table. Do that one because people do not like Vietnam. Uh, I'm going to go to New York. Uh, second one. Uh, the EPA. Makes sense, uh, created the EPA, but. Yeah, just say existing. You don't want to be too, you don't want to lose your base with that. Uh. Yeah, the Courage Initiative. I'm not going to comment on a decision like this one. Uh, I'm going to go to Texas again. Yeah, we have bigger priorities to deal with. What? Okay, I'm going to have to redo that. I don't know why it went down so much. Okay. A comprehensive peace treaty. Yeah, okay. It's gone back to normal. Okay. Um, 
Yeah, don't say communism's here to say do the second one. Uh Yeah. Yeah, why wouldn't I campaign there? These Fort Johnson's intervention in Dominican uh Yeah, I do support the intervention. Okay, sorry about the background noise. Um, so I do support the intervention. We gotta re-examine. Um, yeah, um, he's an American hero. Yeah, you want to be as moderate as possible. That's how you win as Nixon. Uh. Yeah, the inflation rate rate is Democrats' problems. Um, I'll definitely work till the agreement to control the nuclear weapons. Yeah, I don't. First one, and then yeah, stick in the middle, do the middle ground, and I'll go. Okay, I'll go to Texas again. This one's another art. Yeah, so I got it the first time, so your gamble's paid off, so now your lead's gonna go up even more, so let's just see what happens. That's not surprising. Yeah, none of these states are surprising so far. Ohio, that's good. New Jersey, too. And there we go. Uh, 418 to 75. Jeez. Okay. So congratulations. and That's why Reagan's the best. He gives you like a very large majority. That's The other ones are just okay. But congratulations. Despite your intense battle from Humphrey and Wallace, you've disproven the doubters and redeemed your name. Performance in debates and campaign was widely... Uh, compared to praise compared to 1960, which allowed you to win with a massive landslide. What a turnaround from 1964! Murders and rioting in America will you first order business and more long term the war in Vietnam. If most are dealt with, your silent majority will be pleased. Other than that, inflation must be dealt with, as well as the excess of the great society. Good luck and welcome back to the executive branch. So yeah, I mean, Wallace almost has more electoral votes than Humphrey here. Just complete and total landslide ahead. That's why you select Reagan, you get a massive, if you play her, if you do it right, you'd be moderate. And you win the RNG events, you get such a massive landslide. But yeah, uh... 
hope you guys uh enjoyed this video uh if you could please leave, uh comment or leave a like or subscribe that that'd be much appreciated and i'll see you guys later